it enables us, the staff, to begin a planning process with the citizens of the community for the express purpose of coming up with new ideas, new concepts, new approaches to old problem solving. Now, if we are able to accomplish this within the planning period and get approval from Washington for implementation, we will begin to make tremendous impact on the Mall Cities area <clears throat> and be able to experiment with these new ideas and to prove them to be of value. And once that has been done, new policies and new decisions will come throughout the city toward treating these same types of problems. Well, the planning period ends on November the 15th. At that time, uh, it will be about two or three months before we get approval with our first year implementation program. I would say that sometimes within the next 18 months, we will begin to see action on the people's choice of action. In other words, we will begin to implement what they've told us during this planning period they want in eliminating blight and creating a better quality of urban living in the Miles Cities area. Will the people that live in this area have a voice in the direction that these plans take? Uh, part of the uh, program guidelines set up by Washington insists that citizens must be able to participate and to take part in the planning process. So what we come out with as a end result of this program will be a matter of people being able to say what they want.